Let's go to Lewis, who's on the line in Brownsville, Texas. Lewis, you're on the Ken Coleman Show. Hey, Ken. Thanks for taking my call. Sure. How can I help? So, so I'm a bit stuck right now. Um, I'm moving to Sydney, Australia in January of next year to wow. go study at Hillsong College. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, I'm extremely excited for that. But the issue is that I haven't had a stable job for a couple of months now. In July, I thought that I had found a job that was going to work. I, I had been an intern before, and it was a great pay, but it fell through at the last minute. And I've sent out my resume to several employers as well, but I feel like when I mentioned that I'm moving to Australia <laughs> in a couple of months, it's a total turnoff, and it doesn't happen. Well, of course. Now, my quest, Yeah, well, my question would be is that I know that the right thing to do is mention that I'm leaving to Australia in a couple of months, yeah. but how do I do it or say say it to where I can still land the job. I think you for a go a couple of months. Well, I think you you got a couple of months so that, you know, you're not going to land a big time salary job anyway. Right. Okay, so this is uh this is part-time stuff or hourly wage stuff where there's high turnover. You just want to bring in a little bit of money until you take off in January. So right. uh, let's just call this what this is. I'm, I'm just looking for any kind of, you know, they're just hiring people nonstop. You know right. what I mean? Um uh, this is an hourly wage where they really don't care if you're gone in two months. They need help now. Okay. And you understand what I'm saying? So yes, you don't yes. owe them six months. Okay. So that's another myth. No, go work okay. and do a good job for two months. Okay. But, but I mean, go go for an hourly position, something like that, where there's normal high turnover or seasonal turnover or something like that. Make okay. sense? So, even, so I graduated as well in – in May with a degree in business. So I don't even think about that. No, no, <laughs> like because me personally, no, 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 because it's not, it's not right. You don't go get a business job where they think you're locked in for right. at least a year, you know, or right. six months trying to see if this is a good fit. You're, you're temporary. You need temporary work. That's all you need. Right. How much money you want to make? Right. So, um, I want to make at, at least by the, by the time I leave, at least, Two thousand dollars. <laughs> okay, bro. You know you can go deliver pizzas and make two thousand dollars. Okay, you can right. you can go do laboring work. You can go work on a brick crew, or I mean, I, I don't even know where to start. There's so many ways right. in Brownsville, Texas, that you can go get a, a temporary job, uh, a, a, or a part time job, or two part time jobs, and make two thousand right. dollars. Stop thinking about right. this and go do it. This is this is exciting. You're going off in the next chapter. You only got two months. I want to make two thousand dollars. You need to just simply write down where are all the jobs in Brownsville, Texas, where I could probably make two thousand dollars in two months. Just go do that. It's not a dream job. It's not a sweet spot. It's just I'm trying to make some money to fund my next step in some form or fashion. Stop thinking. Start working. 